Welcome back guys. We're well, out now bagging a few more trigs but these ones are totally different to the ones you've seen. Not in as the trig but where they're located. I'm actually on a high point up right up in Hexhamshire. So you're gonna get a shock because I'm literally just parked there. That's where I'm parked. Absolutely shocking. I thought I might have had to have a decent walk, but I've got four of these that I want to get rid of. So, Hexham Racecourse, I couldn't get to it. There's obviously an event going on and it's in the grounds like. So, guys, you're going to laugh, but this is the trig. Boosh. Another one bites the dust, Hexham coming. Um, I think it's about 200 and something metres. So that's number one done of today. So let's get them done. This is where we were before, right over here. So this one, I think it's Eastleys or Eastleys or East Westley fields. To hang about on these fells when we we're kids. That's what they call the gap through there. Whew. So I didn't need to bring a pack rucksack because it's only 400 yards up this road. So but what I'm doing at the minute I'm bagging the ones locally to us. Um So, and once I've bagged these ones, I'll then do the ones up in the Northumberland National Park area um, in Kielda and that. I'm, I've only got a few to do with Kielda. So, we'll bash on and get this done. I'll bring you back, guys. Boosh. So as you can see, it's an absolute corking day. A little bit of a breeze, that's nout. So this farm's got a weird name called Salomon Field. <laughs> it is, it's really weird. So there's the trig, and as you'll see, it's in really good condition. That's that one done. I think this one, you can see, it's Lily Woods in the distance here. Absolute fells over there. Deal fells, I should say. So, that's that. I'm alright, like, I, it's, 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 uh, I've been a bit unwell recently, like, so that's why I haven't been a while camping. I'm just trying to get my fitness back. Over a month I've been off. Um, so, uh, so East Light Side it's called East Light Side that's the one I've just been to so and my next one I'm not sure what it's called but it's in a wood and the wood's been cut out so it'll be a nightmare to walk through so we'll have to put my boots on for that I've just got my train hat on and it's so yes week which is about eight mile so it's the bag three trigs I think is it three I think three two or three but they're a canny way apart so I'm just gonna walk them because it means driving and I think it's it'd be nicer if I just walk them so across the fells actually it's over here it's where it is so you'll get to see them once so hello guys well, this is Barley Hill, I'm about to approach the 
Stone Reservoir is down in the bottom here. But Barley Hill is literally, it's the closest. It's only four metres from the road, which is shocking. But amazingly. So this is Barley, Barley Hill, Barley Hill Trig. So this is, um, I'll put it all in the description anyways. But yeah, it's absolutely mint, as you can see. Obviously, had a problem with fly tipping. Yes. So, this is another one. Now, this one's supposed to be in the tree plantation somewhere. So, this is going to be fun trying to find this. So, you'll know about this. I've walked around here loads. Obviously, I'm just parked just down there. <laughs> just honestly, they're so close. So, this one, this one. And another one is about one of the, it's not really that long, to be truthful. So we'll just have to go off the GPS and hopefully find this one. Aye, because I'm not quite sure where it'll be in the wood. So it'll be a bit of trial and error. And the trees have grown a lot since I was last up this way. So I'll bring you back guys when we get on a bit more. So guys, I tried to get in that other way. You kind of get in. Nah, it's horrendous. Yeah, absolutely horrendous. So at the minute, I'm busy walking through here, but even this is not the best. But we'll persevere, because I think we'll get this way to it. Yeah. So I'll bring you back when we get there. God, someone has actually painted it. Jesus, boom, God, that was a yomp and a half, bloody hell, someone's obviously re recently painted it, it must be a nightmare for them to get to. So guys, this is called Win Now's Common, what a name, so it's actually right in the centre really. I don't know whether it's trying, worth trying to get back that way. God, because it was bloody horrendous trying to get through it. Aye. So, another one done. So, on to the next one. Boosh. Welcome, guys. So, this is the trig. The trig is actually up there. Well, guys, so I've came in from that gate which is just along there. Um, I don't know if you can see because of the shining sun. The footpath actually goes that way, but we're gonna skirt around this little bit of boundary and walk up because um, the land actually, the um, trig's actually in this field at the top corner. So um, I, I used to look after all of these woods few many moons ago so I could actually go through here and up that hedge line but I, I don't know I hope it's hope the trigger isn't on that side but you know we'll just walk up here if we get stopped we'll get stopped we shouldn't like not if you explain to people that you're just um looking for a trig point so whew, that's warmed us up <clears throat> Amazing views from up here. Whoo! Dilson Trig. Done. 
Well, I think, I think, I want to say it's about 400 meters, but I don't think it is. It's 300 and something. So, uh, unfortunately, it's got a little bit of damage. You can see. So, but I, looks in good condition, needs a paint. But look at the views, man. It's amazing, the views. It's absolutely amazing. It is. You know where it's at. So get out and do some walking. Good for the mind, good for the soul. Out. So guys, that's bye 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 from Dilson Trig. And uh, so we'll just head back the same way we came. Back to the van. And uh, that's an another group of uh, tricks done. And uh, it's getting a little bit chilly now, like. Um, so, I think that's how many I've done five. I couldn't get the race course one done, but which I can bag that at any time, because I'm always passing. It's not, it's not even a couple of hundred meters from the road, maybe 200 meters. So I can bag that at any time. I could bag it in the dock if I wanted. So, the next time, my well, next bagging lot um, is going to be over up on the fells here. Uh, the Allendale Fells and Blanchland Fells, Bullbeck, and another one, uh, Warlock, I think it's Warlock they call it. So, they'll be the ones I'll be bagging next. Uh, I think there's three. Once I've bagged them, I've done the fell. Then I'll go to the other side of the fell and I start there and do the Allendale Valley. So, I've done all the other side of uh, um, walk area so that's all finished I've done a lot around the Cheviots to start with which I'll be just bagging again anyways more likely to be on wild camps so till the next time stay safe and you know where it's at right here so get out and do some walking Boom.